welcome to my very first video. Uh, this is an unboxing of the Planner Society March kit. Um, I've already opened it up and took off the label, but I haven't opened it up. And I used a hairdryer to take off the sticker. This is my first time trying that, but it did leave some sticky residue. So I don't know if that's better than ripping the paper or we'll see, maybe I can cover it with a sticker or a die cut. But I really love how it's stamped on the box. And my favorite part of these kits is always the paper because it's a thinner thin, uh, the bag. It's, since it's so thin, it doesn't add a lot of bulk to my planner when I do decide to cover things up. Okay. And this kit has a rose gold theme as seen um, in the Instagram sneak peeks for the Planner Society. And I'm sorry about the glare, so let's go through this All right, one by one. All right, so the first thing are these tabs, and I never know how to use the tabs. They always come with the labels, um, and I do believe they come with four sheets, two of each, and they look like hand handwriting. And we have all of these tabs, and they're so pretty, but I never know how to use them. So if you can come up with any suggestions, leave them in the comments below. And then we have this planner clip, which I don't know if I could actually use it in mine since I have a coil bound planner. But I know that for if you're into TNs, Traveler Into Notebooks, uh, this one would fit perfectly on the elastic. And then if you have a ring bound, which I used to use a ring bound, but it didn't quite work for me. You can attach this clip and then stick this loop on your ring. Super pretty. Right. Sorry, I'm a little sniffly today because I have I have allergies. Okay, here we have our washi tape. And it's I always love the washi tape. Although for some reason last month's one with the yellow, I didn't quite like this one. Look, it has like a has a gold, seems to have a gold um, accent to it. You see that? It's so pretty, this one. I really like the pink and the green. Alright, so we have that. Alright. And then, oh, this pen is so pretty. Look, it has the gold flakes in the liquid. And, oops. And this one is a twist. I'm not a huge fan of the ballpoint, so I, for some reason I love the pens, but I never use them very often. Alright. Oh, and then we apparently have stencils this month. Every month the kit is a little different. Obviously the designs are different, but she includes different items every month. Oh, these are super pretty, but for some reason I didn't even use the last stencils that we got a couple months back. But maybe I could use something with like stamping or something. Alright. I'm super excited about these gold, rose gold puffy stickers. I never use puffy stickers, so maybe I'm, I'm hoping that I can use them this month. Not sure what yet, but they're super pretty. Look, all right, all right. Then we have this bag of stickers. And I always try to take off the sticker. Oh, it's ripping. I should have tried to take off with the hair dryer again. sad. Oh, I'll just have to reuse the paper, but... Oh, 
it's double packaged. All right, so we have these mini sheets of stickers. Ooh, it's foiled. Ooh, these words have rose gold foil. I don't know if you can see that. Super pretty. And then these are all foiled. Right. Pineapples! Oh, these are pretty too. I know the design looks a little funky, but I think Christy in her videos or posts said that they went with a new company. So the cut is on the inside of the design. So there's no white space around it. So that's why it looks a little funky on the edges, but the cutout is, there's that, I don't know what to call it, border of extra design. And then we have this one. Super pretty. I especially like the rose gold uh, words. All right. And then, ooh, page flags. Am I the only one who never seems to fully use page flags? I don't understand and why I can't seem to use them, but these are super pretty. I'm really into wood grain right now, so I'm really loving those, but I don't know if I would use these, but I just hoard them. I'm really trying hard not to hoard things. Okay, now confession, my biggest addiction is die cuts. Like when I first started planning, I just bought all the die cuts. It was pretty hilarious. I still have tons of die cuts and I never used them all. I can't take, I can't bring myself to use them all, but they're so pretty. Oh, the trench coat. We have some books. The Planner Society and some flats. Pineapples. I'm really loving the pineapple and the roses. GPS girl. Oh, I think one dropped. Oh, noted. The chairs. I never used to like chairs until I started getting the Planner Society kit. Planner girl. Some luggage. What is this? Oh, is this is a shirt? Top? Bag? I don't know what this is. <laughs> All right, and then we have some flowers. Oh, I really like this constellation design. It reminds me of one of my other die cuts that I have. And more chairs and flowers. TPS love. Bow. Oh, look, it's a diamond, glitter diamond on a paperclip design. Pen cup and another full clip super cute. I, I'm also not one to really use clips for some reason. I can't get into them. Then we have this one. Ooh, more pineapple. Oh yay, there's a bigger version. Constellation with stars. Cup. <laughs> Done. Oh, TPS number five. That one's super pretty. Oops, I'm sorry. I was out of frame. And then hello. All right. And then these, I don't know what to call these clips. Like they kind of look like bobby pins, but with this on it. And then I guess you slide it on. I don't know how, like, would, I don't think this would work with my ankle press planner. I don't know. I'm gonna have to find the, something to use it for, but I really like the rose gold one. I don't know about the glitter. I feel like the glitter would fall off, but I guess we could try it and see. This is more like a gray, but with glitter on it. I have to open it up and see, but I'm not gonna open it up now. All right, and then we have stamps. I really love the stamps. These are a little smaller than I expected. I saw it in the Instagram picture, but, so here's my finger. It's kind of small, but, I guess that would fit really well in a personal size planner. I really love the pineapple though. Pineapple on the constellation heart. Oh, 
sorry, I'm fangirling over this. All right, and then we have these cards. I never use these cards to the fullest, so that's my goal this, this year is to really try to use everything that's in my kit. You know, these go well on dashboards, but I only use dashboards since I have a bound planner. Okay, big things often have small beginnings. And we have successful people never worry about what others are doing. The future belongs to those who believe in chasing their dreams. This one has black ink. The other ones had rose gold. This one's also black. If it's still in your mind, it's worth taking the risk. That's how I feel about tattoos. <laughs> I never know what I would want to get for a tattoo. So that's why I don't have any right now because my mind keeps changing. So if it's not in my mind, I can't say that I, I would I would commit my whole life to a that certain design. Uh, you can't buy happiness, but you can buy planners. And that's a, that's nearly the same. I love this. This is so my life. That's in rose gold. And then this one's black. You are the creator of your own destiny. Oh, the destiny kind of didn't print all the way. I wonder. It's probably not on purpose. Eh, it's character. And then the last thing is this paper. Ooh, this is the first time it's all shrink wrapped. Okay, I'm gonna need to get some scissors. I wasn't expecting this. Okay, hold on. Sorry about that. I wasn't ready for scissors, for needing scissors. I know last month, like normally the paper is just in the bag loose and then last month they included vellum and acetate and it was and that itself was in its own bag but had a sticky opening i don't know why i can't open this for some reason i'm sorry my first video and i'm not even ready there we go all right oh there's vellum this vellum is super pretty all right so we have this vellum with the pink and super pretty. Ooh, this one is gold, rose gold foiled. That one is super pretty. And acetate, the marble acetate. And this rose gold. It's not gold, but it's color. It's not foiled, but it's the same color. It's super thick acetate, too. Oh my gosh, this is so pretty. And she includes six sheets of paper, double-sided. So then that way you can use six different sides. I think this is my favorite so far. Well, it's the first one, but it's pineapples and it's rose gold foiled. We get two, and then on the other side, we have the roses. Oh, I don't know. I'm going to be torn about which side to use. Oh, first world problems. And then, so this is the first time she's included foiled paper, which is really cool. So here's a second sheet. Um, this one's also rose gold foil of the floral pattern. And on the other side is more roses. Let's see how it compares. Kind of similar, similar colors, but different design. I don't know how she comes up with all of her designs. They're so pretty. I don't have that kind of creative mind. <laughs> and then we have, what is this? Like a wood green but with stitching, embroidery, and on the other side, oh, I really like this one. It has a wood grain with like a black rose, like a navy, and like the flowers, super pretty. Like I said, I'm kind of obsessed with wood grain right now. Can't help it. Wood grain and pastel. So I think this is one of my favorite kits so far, and I've been a subscriber since, um... 
January of 2016. I really, really liked the April kit of last year, which was what the, her line of Planner Society planners that she released earlier this, uh, late last year that were shipped earlier this year, um, that black with the floral, that one was super pretty. And I think that was my favorite for a really long time, but I think this is going to surpass that the pink and the rose gold. I think I really love that pineapple motif and the constellation heart or diamond. I totally advise you to get this kit if you if you have additional funds lying around it's definitely a nice surprise to have even though I see the sneak peeks on Instagram and insta stories I think it's really a nice treat to get every month um, this is the one subscription that I do get and I totally never regret it um, I never use everything which I really need to make a habit of actually trying to use everything but that is a problem that I have to figure out. <laughs> but thanks for joining me on my first video, and I hope you weren't too bored. Thanks for watching!